So, basically, I am leaving tomorrow on a trip to go and babysit my cousins. But on that trip, as you can see right here, I'm going to be knitting with this awesome brand new yarn that I just got. Uh, it's cotton yarn from uh, Peaches. I can't remember where I got it, but it's nice brown. I'm gonna be knitting some gloves, and this will just be y'all's vlog around with me. I actually have done this a couple of times a year, babysitting my cousins, I mean, that live ways away. Actually, let's have a quick flashback to that. Hello oh, everybody, welcome back. It's your girl Faith and Sold, and I know I look like a mess. Let's start over. So, this coming week, which basically means tomorrow, Sunday, <laughs> I have got to go on a trip to grandmother and I were supposed to go and watch my cousins, but <laughs> if it turns out I still can't go, uh, then she's gonna have to go without me, probably take my cousin in my place, which I really hope is not the case because I really do feel better. Now, the reason she might have to go along on and the reason, uh, I, uh, my, our trips have been kind of on the mend for the past, um, uh, couple days now, uh, <laughs> I actually hurt my foot. <laughs> yeah, uh, I, you probably can't see the bruise, and I don't really know if you want to, and it's pretty much practically on now, because, like, I got it on, what day was that? I think it was Thursday? 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 Thursday or Wednesday, I'm pretty sure. It was probably Thursday. Uh, but <laughs> I bruised my foot when I was out playing with my brother, <laughs> and I had not really been able to walk on it at all. It was pretty bad, pretty swelled, so I put a lot of ice on it, and it's been on the mend for the past couple days, and so far, um, I think I can walk on it. I've been walking on it throughout the house so far. What I mean is what I think I can put. I think I'm okay. I think it's all better now. I think so. At least I hope so. Uh... <laughs> But, uh, I've been using, uh, this cane just kind of, it's a, it's a crutch that I want to have there just in case. I don't want to lean too much into it just out of habit. I just want it there in case, like, I feel like I can't handle it. But I've been walking around and it's been, been pretty good. So, uh, we're gonna hope that that is all better and that I can go tomorrow because like we got to get up early tomorrow if I'm going and I really wrote some fingers crossed fingers crossed that it's all better Kane you shall no longer be my Kane it's like it felt really good yesterday I didn't really put a whole bunch of weight on it I tried putting weight on it for like uh, like actual try to walk with it for the first time yesterday it was pretty okay uh couldn't put a whole bunch, but I used the cane and walked around a lot. And today, I can walk without the cane, so I'm really I'm really hoping so. I'm really hoping that it's all better. But uh, before we talk anymore and I will have her on, let us go and take a shower because I look nasty. Okay, I'm back. Hair's washed. I still need to brush it, and I am icing my foot. I am also in the middle of wrapping my dad's birthday present, which is awesome because yesterday was his birthday. Happy birthday, daddy!
here. Yay! Yeah, so that's what happened the last couple times, and now I'm going again, so... Mm. Lightning almost struck twice. I slipped on that railing. <sighs> So, the preacher preached today on hypocrisy, and he also preached on hypocrisy that was you wearing a mask, but instead of just trying to look good for everyone, you were just trying to hide your shame, which is something I deal with a lot because I didn't really realize how much that was hypocrisy. I just thought it was making sure no one asked. If someone asked me, I would say I was okay because I wouldn't want to burden them with my problems. And I was like, it's my own problem. It's between me and God. Why should I ask for help when I know, like, for one, I was afraid that they would reject me for it. And secondly, I've always, like been hard to trust people which is something I'm dealing <laughs> having very hard time trying to put my trust fully in God I know I that he's real and I believe in him and I know I should it's just really hard to let go of the reins because I guess I'm a little bit of a control freak <laughs> but he talked about how we make it seem so easy and I think of it like through social media since I do a lot of that, that it's so easy for people to see only one side of a person. And I know, like in my mind, I don't see the full picture. I don't see what, all what's happening. But sometimes we uh, forget to let make sure whenever we're sharing our lives on social media to share the other parts of the filter. To not just let you see all the great stuff that's going on because... Yes, there's always going to be great stuff seen by others, but not everyone will see the hard and difficult situations that come by, the troubles, like the either the inward struggles or the outward struggles. And I never want to be that way with social media or especially if I lie to myself and do that self hypocrisy thing about hiding my shame because and sometimes trying to make sure lie to myself into believing that if everyone's okay and everyone thinks I'm fine then I am fine when that's not really true and I guess I want to take steps to start opening up to y'all and to open up myself to God as well and this will be I'll always keep a part of it that's just between me and him. But I'm trying to learn to open up to uh, my friends that I think are good, godly Christian people and be more open to talking with them and asking them their advice and for their prayers to help me get through this rough patch I've been with God for longer than I care to remember. But... Uh, that's all I'm going to say right now because I'm rambling on. Uh, so I'll see you in the next clip.
this week has been really, really crazy. I'm trying not to talk real loud uh, because everyone else is asleep. It's like 10 o'clock and I'm about to go to sleep myself, so... But I really, I took a break. Today is Thursday. Just have 